shorts are a new, um, relatively new YouTube feature, which I haven't experimented a lot with, but I thought I'd give it a go this morning. So I produced a short video, which is basically an edit of one of my existing nursery rhyme videos and uploaded it. And as you can see within the first hour or so of uh, going live, it's done. Just refresh the screen. No, that's the wrong screen, this screen. 500 and was it 570 something? I don't know. Come on, uh, 582. Wow. Five, well, 582 video. Sorry, 582. I'm still up asleep. 582 <laughs> views in the first hour or so. Um, well, whoopee do, big deal. Doesn't mean a lot. However, if you look at the curve here in the analytics, this would be what um, a new video that I release on this channel would typically do. This so far is what the new video has done. So um, it's saying here it's done 362, sorry, 362 views more than usual within the time frame uh, that um, has been reported on, which so far is about the first hour or so. So if this carries on, this is going to significantly outperform uh, the way that the videos would normally perform. So how do you do this? Uh, what, what changes do you need to make to the way that you upload your video in order to get an enhanced uh, boost? It's actually really simple. All you do is you make a video which is less than 60 seconds long. And rather than doing it in portrait, you do it in landscape. So that way as opposed, no, sorry. Yeah, that way as opposed to that way. Upload it and in the description just put the normal stuff and uh, stick a hashtag short in the description and uh, make sure that your title is nice and short i think keep it less than 40 characters and stick the hashtag short in the title um and that's it just upload it and you should get a significant boost compared to your normal videos, because what YouTube will see then is it's a special type of video called a short, um, which it puts in a, a, a separate rack on the on the mobile app. I really am half asleep still. I shouldn't be doing this video really, but I just thought I'd share it. Um, downsides of doing shorts. Downsides, potential downsides are that if your subscribers have subscribed in order to see <laughs> long videos and you do short videos, then arguably you're not delivering on your promise. However, I wouldn't worry about that too much because um, most of your views will come from non-subscribers. Most people don't realize that actually. Subscribers are good and they're important for some reasons, but uh, most of your views on your channel <coughs> will come from people who are not subscribed to your channel. Um, and I'll demonstrate that if I can remember where it is. Come back where I analytics. Uh, let's have a look. Audience. Yeah. So, no. Where is it? Yeah. Look at this. Um, even on quite a mature channel, ninety-five point three percent of the people uh, of the views are coming from people who are not subscribed to my channel. So. If I uh, annoy a few of them and even lose a few subscribers, but get a lot more views, uh, arguably strategically, that's OK, because the subscribers will start to come back anyway. Right. That's it. Um, I am actually going to go off for a walk now. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to go off for a walk. It's funny, isn't it? Like, I just can't get motivated now. I used to get up out of bed every day at six o'clock walk for six and a half, oh, more than that, half past five walk five walk for six and a half miles since lockdown i just can't be asked to do anything i'm getting fat and i hate it so anyway i'm off but there's a tip for today maybe um if you want me to cover it in more detail or whatever not that there is a lot more detail let me know in the comments and maybe we'll do that on another live session right i'm off have a great day folks lots of love merry christmas etc